Welcome to my Honorable Recruits, this is day 3 of me being zombie cringes. Zombie cringes active! Yeah, 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 thank you for good way respect. Let's begin, let's begin. Even if the setting had changed, even if the killing was finished, he was still the same as usual. <laughs> like how I said that. I said it like it was like a nonchalant, like a Monokuma be Monokuma, you know man, Monokuma, Um... What? What is going on? Outside world? Main cast? Somehow I have a bad feeling about this. Um... Yeah, a pretty accurate feeling. It's the right moment to have this feeling. Lots of characters in the Danganronpa series have these random feelings and it is a completely wrong moment to have such feeling. An example, Hajime. He's worried that everybody left him behind here. Yeah? And then it, he, he, he didn't even go outside to look. And then he goes outside to look and he sees a ghost with Tego berries. So that's just things that we have to pay attention to. Right, hey, right, hey. good hey. ghost, Sonia. Like he keeps this thing, uh, this place is Hope Speak Academy. Hmm. But, but that's impossible, right? What are you saying? How would we make it back to Hope Speak Academy from a tropical island in the first place? It's impossible. It cannot there be. There is no place for Hope Speak Academy to exist on Chubbawalk Island. <laughs> I said I wanted to go back, but I didn't want to go back to a creepy place like this. What does this mean? So many things I don't understand have happened on the island. This building, is really Hope Speak Academy? <laughs> This is this is the Hope Speak Academy I've been admiring for so long. What in the world is going on? Damn it! Why is this happening? This is usually just the part where Chiaki appears on screen. Is like, Hajime, you need to stay calm. Remember, we have a goal to accomplish. Why? Um, um, pub, play a uh, happy, jolly tune, yeah? I was finally able to attain Hope Speak Academy. I finally thought I'd become confident in myself. Even so, I... Why did you become Hope? If that's what you're thinking, just stop it. Listen carefully. The only humans worthy of becoming Hope possess amazing talents and a strong will. And the moment you're born into this world, you either have it or you don't. Oh uh, yeah, dude, I, I just remembered, you ruined the ultimate pharmacist's life. She she had that kind of... Was she shy? And we never really got an ounce of her personality. She was badass, she took some drugs and then she turned into super beast. But before that, you were pretty cute. What the hell did you do, man? You ruined her life. It has nothing to do with effort. You must be chosen by hope to become hope. That's why it's not even worth admiring. Or oh, were you so blinded by your admiration for of Hope Speak Academy that you couldn't even see that? It's like you get stabbed in the side and like You are just some nobody from the reserve course who never had talent to begin with. Ain't nobody who forgot he was a nobody. That's all. If I really am a nobody then you should have just left me alone. Why? I don't have to go through something like this. Um... Hajime, did something happen? Huh? Hey, bastard! Now's not the time to zone out. Sorry. It's nothing. Um... I don't really get it, but is that all? I'm getting... As long as I don't have to beat the crap out of... As long as I don't have to beat the crap out of Monokuma, nothing's gonna be solved. Is that what it means? Hey! What the heck is Monokuma anyway? He's not part of Future Foundation, right? Um... If you say that... Then, what is Future Foundation? The foundation of the future. They lay the foundation towards the light. That is Future Foundation. With its bunch of builders, construction workers, and so on. They wear the hard yellow hats. Jeez. Even though Chiyaki and Monami are gone, the situation hasn't changed one bit, which means the Future Foundation wasn't our enemy. That's the only thing I can think of. You serious? So, so they were not world into they we were in Sigma Monokuma. No, you guys are tricked by Mika. Because you went to go believe in her when she had the spare disease and everybody was like, Mika's a friend. 
He can trust that. Sure, sure, sure. Put the mic on. He can do the values. Ah, nobody remember the orgasmic look she had on her face as she was being sentenced to death on the first of the end. Like, the, the first, like the first thing. She, 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 she enjoyed the death by first. Tango and Opa gave the censored version of the first thing. <laughs> ah, so we can just... Woo. However, the future foundation is responsible for trapping us on this island, right? Regarding that matter, I believe Monomy never once denied that. Damn it. If they are allies, might not just be allies. Maybe Monokum was telling us to investigate the information on our own. Chiaki said she could not betray the future foundation, but if she was still alive, she definitely would have helped us. No, even her just being with us would have been a big help. Hmm. What should we do? Damn it. Well, it's obvious. If we're gonna get out of here safely, we have to do that graduation exam, right? So annoying. Graduation exam, huh? I'm already good at taking exams. Huh. But I guess it's better than people dying. Jeez. Monokuma said something about the field trip, right? Is he telling us to investigate like we have been? Alright! I'm gonna do it. Prepare yourself. Prepare yourself for my jerk I tried thinking of trap card, but like usually something would have just been like flash in my mind, say it. But I'm zombie cringes right now. Needle bug eater, send five cards to the graveyard. In other words, lose the trial and we all die. What you doing here, Pneida? Hey? Like. Yeah, we might be able to learn something about Oak Speak Academy, about ourselves. Uh, I don't care if we don't know anymore. If we can just go back to our normal lives, I'm fine! Hey! hey can we go home with us over, right? Where we can finally get over this damn island, right? <laughs> That's the case, let's all leave this island alive by any means. Of course! Hell yes! He's right. Now's not the time to bemoan how lucky I am. Where this place really is, what's happened to Hopespeak Academy? None of that matters. What's important is, I need to leave this island with the others. We sacrificed so many lives in order to survive just so we could do that. There's no way we can stop now, but Monokuma should already know that's what we're thinking. So why did he say that? We have to decide on our own whether or not we want to leave Jabberwock Island. He should already know that we'd never choose to stay on this island. Hey, hey! So what are we gonna do? Can we start already? Hmm. Uh, but what are we even looking for? Do we just have to investigate this weird ass building? Even so. I don't think we'll be able to find the answers to our questions or to all our questions inside this damn building. <laughs> well, that's going ahead for now. Whoa! Are you already going? Jeez. What's this idiot thinking running ahead without being cautious? Man. He obviously doesn't think about anything. However. It will be fine. There will no longer be any situations where you might see changes in other's lives. All right. So we should do our best as well. Like they say, it's not scary if everyone stops at the green light. It's not scary. If everyone stops at a green light. For who? For who? For who is it not scary? I feel like she's saying a say, saying it wrong again and it's confusing shit out of me. We, if we stop at the green light, we'd never reach our goal. Jeez. I can't even off on our own. It might be faster if we split up and look around too. Huh. Like Sonia said, there's no more killing. We don't have to worry about anyone betraying us anymore. <laughs> and then let's get over with and go home. Yeah, uh, until someone maybe uh, throws a throws a slice at Sonia, Kazuichi gets all yandere on us and stabs us multiple times in the chest. Sonia stabs him in the chest. And Akane beats shit out of Sonia. And Fuyuhiko's the last man standing with Akane in a blood rage mode. Which might not last long. I kind of wins in this situation. Fatality. Later. Go on ahead. I'll see you guys later. With those brief words, Fuyiko left the gymnasium. Excuse me? I shall do my best to obtain a wonderful clue that will help be useful to everyone. Now then, please excuse me. Sonia took a deep bow and then left the gymnasium. Oh my. Oh, Miss Sonia. Miss Sonia. Miss Sonia. Please don't leave me. I'll be in danger if I'm left alone. Kasuichi chased after Sonia while I just departed and left the gymnasium. Yo, uh, yo, I just made we get it, man. We in the gymnasium, chill. I should hurry and start too, just a bit more, and I left the gymnasium. 
If you say it, man, I'm gonna be pissed. If you say it, man, I'm gonna be pissed. And it's going to end. I can escape this nightmare and return to my usual peaceful everyday life that you hated completely with a burning passion because of how monotonous everything was. I mean, dude. The only thing we can do is advance the world that hope. Most exciting thing that happened in your entire life. And you're like, nah, let's go back. Boring mode it is. Even though I don't understand, and a lot of the horrifying things keep happening. For the sake of everyone who couldn't make it this far, I'm definitely going to go home. Investigation! Hey, Morikawa! I knew you could do it! I knew I could do it too, Morikawa. Huh? That's weird. It's the whole way I walked through to get to the gymnasium, but it's clearly different. Is this Monokuma's doing too? Is he trying to confuse us again? I don't know how he's doing it, but he keeps doing it over and over again. He's so persistent. But I'm not gonna fall for his trap. Top. There's no way <laughs> this will make it hit me back down. So you find anything? Um. This hallway. There's a strange feeling to it. No, as if. An invisible wall has been erected. Ha! Is she said erected? To limit our movement. I am ha. concerned. Is it just me? Well, Rodo, I'm guessing, right? Rodo? Rodo? Ah. Oh. Is Rodo written on the door? Yes! This is the dojo. It's full of strange things that make me think there's no way we're inside a school. Perhaps a mistake to expect the inside of this building to make sense. Yeah, th this is your academy that you love so much. This is what I'm just saying. Hmm? What's this? A Easter Hope Speak Academy by Monokuma with cute anime girl. <laughs> oh! Uh, 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 I have a feeling it might be of the H Tai creation. And it, usually when you see H Tai covers and it's all bright and dusty and candy. It's dark on the inside, and death, and tragedy, and sadness, and misery. Do not open an age tie if it's colorful on the outside, like extremely bright, and amazing, beautiful, and pretty. Or if there's shadows in the background, because then you're just a cuckold. Is this a manga? The title is... Manga for Morons, the history of Speak Academy, Babarakuba! Why is a manga which has such a spacious looking title hanging open like this? That's <laughs> not History first, class. Hey! Reading a manga is the third best way to learn about history. Then what's the first, you ask? It depends on the person. Loving within the history? Going back in time and changing the history? Watching an anime about the history? Shooting up the history? What do you mean, Monokuma? So it's just as I thought. Monokuma made this. It totally explains how suspicious it looks. Yes, the little symbol in the corner did not explain what... Fine, I'll look at it. I'll look at anything that might be a clue to getting out of here, no matter what it is. I picked up the manga off the floor and started flipping through the pages. It's an introduction to Hope Speak Academy's history. It's now right about the cruise duty character on the cover. A story begins with an introduction to Hope Speak Academy. Yes, and remember when I said about all bright, cute, colorful candy and uh, now what is Hope Speak Academy's history really like? Misery. Trust, to trust, to stab in the back and distrust and despair and Executions and death, and sadness, misery. Who's we? Who's we? Academy is government funded school, privileged by only the most talented high school students can hope to attend. Both today's hope and the nation's future. Many of us alumni are key leaders in various industries. New students are chosen through the scouting process, but the ones who scout them are most big academy teachers who serve as both educators and research on talent. Most Week Academy isn't just a school for talent, it's also a school for interesting talent as well. However, for the past few years, Host Week Academy has been suffering from a decline in funding. If this persists, the Academy believes they will not be able to make progress with their research of talent. Uh, is that before or after the 2,000 kids of themselves? 
So I decided to implement a new system to reserve department. Okay, before. I like to be in department with scouts for the students to reserve department and utilize general entrance exam. Normal faculty leave was hired and placed in charge of looking after reserve department. The expenses and exam fees for reserve department were quite high compared to most high schools. Nevertheless, Hope's Academy received an endless stream of applicants. Hope's Academy is now available to talented companies. People only care about the brand. With this, Hope's Academy managed to amass sizable funds and further came and began further research of the talent. Great Hope's Academy's earnest wish, a true genius will become mankind's hope. But just when they thought everything was going well, an unprecedented incident occurred. The other, uh, the most tragic, most awful, most the su self offing inducing, most crazy, most misery infying, if it, what, the worst event of human history. The answer to that secret tragedy, the biggest, most awful, most tragic event in human history. That's right, it was the tragedy of Hope Speak Academy. Hope Speak Academy was crippled by the incident and was forced to shut down rather than accomplishing anything. The end. Ooh. Oh. I thought there was going to be sadness and misery. But there was. Because you know. And I know. They might not know yet, but we know. Huh? The ending was so sudden. Like a manga that suddenly cancelled in the middle of its run. Oh! Now... A manga that's cancelled in the middle of its run is terrible. But the manga that promises a second season that, that is never comes is even worse. No game, no life, destroyed me, okay? Plus, this phrase is mentioned at the bottom at the end of this manga. The tragedy and the tragedy of Hope Speak Academy. These are names so melodramatic. There's no way this incident really happened, right? You're doing the same thing at night. Nah, give them did about the memories. Oh no, we cannot believe. Yeah, Photoshop totally. Blah blah blah. This manga only mentions the names, so I don't really know the details. But no, it'd just be a waste of time to wonder about the things that don't make sense. More importantly, I learned something because of this manga, the reserve department. That department is only pulled to collect money. I was one of those reserve course students, right? But hold on. Hmm, that's weird. Oh. You're here again. See? Ah, the thing that's weird is you, of course. I'm not the weird one. You're the weird one. You're the animatronic bear here. Huh? Hey, why did you forget that you were a part of the reserve department? The Future Foundation only took away your school life memories, right? But you should have known even before you entered that you had no talent, right? So I think it's weird that you actually forgot something like that too. Well, what do you want me to say, huh? By the hmm. way... Based on my assumption, the Future Foundation must have wanted to hide the fact that you were one of those reserve course students. I got it! Oh, you willingly sealed those memories yourself. Huh? <laughs> you wanted to be confident in yourself, so you wanted to forget everything that embarrassed you. You know, when you was experienced trauma, sometimes they raise a memory for what happened. <laughs> they made purpose pretty often, not that I know anything about it though. Are you saying that it's my fault I forgot? That's not it. Come on! When things get inconvenient, you always get angry and try to brush it off. Wait, wait, first I need to get angry. Better? Well... Well, that's expected of a of course, Steven. Damn it! What the heck? This other part where there's been added to the bullet search on the handbook. I don't remember what one it was in. Oh. Oh, there's no clues. If Monokuma really wanted to torment Naegi, they was watching all of this. They would have added, like, the scene that killed Naegi. Like, you walk into the, 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 the green room, the greenhouse, and then, like, there's Mukuro's body. There's Mukuro's body. On the floor. Ah, there's the room. Room 5A, isn't room 5A the one where all the students died? No, no it's not. This is another manga, thing on top of the desk. The Tragedy of Hope Speak Academy by Monokuma. Um, this one is... Manga for morons, The Tragedy of Hope Speak Academy! Why didn't the Tragedy of Hope Speak Academy mention the other manga too? That's why Hope Speak Academy went bankrupt and... Was the trigger for the biggest, most awful, most tragic, most self offing inducing, most awful, most misery inspiring event in human history. If I read this manga, will I be able to learn a little more about that incident? 
Do 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 do. I took the manga from the desk and started flipping through the pages to see what I could learn about the event known as the tragedy of Old Speak Academy. The story made heavy use of outdated stylized drawings depicting characters solving mysteries. What's written here is As the name is success, the tragedy of Old Speak Academy occurred at Old Speak Academy! Wow, I didn't know that! The key player in that event was a was a student named Isaru Kamakura. Isaru was a genius known as a symbol of hope. Old Peak Academy used all the resources to develop him. Supposedly, Isaru was a genius among geniuses and possessed various talents. When he was superior to Alan Hope speak for Hope speak for Hope Mankind, the Academy referred to Isaru as the ultimate hope. To protect such a terror talent, the Academy had completely concealed all evidence of Isaru's origins and identity. Because of that, most of the students at the Academy were completely unaware of Isaru's existence. But Isaru, was known as a symbol of hope, was responsible for a horrible incident. Thirteen students of Hope Speaks Academy Student Council among the Academy's best and brightest were brutally murdered by Isaru. No, 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 no. No, 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 they were not. Junko walked in with the screen, said, I have your loved ones, kill each other or else, and that's what they did. Unless I must ignore that part and just focus on the games, in which case there's a gap between the, the between just before the first game, this game, uh, there's just a gap, alright? However, the incident did not end there. The Academy tried to break check Israel's superior talent and conceal the incident as though it never happened. However, as other students began working in secret to use that incident to their advantage, the student uncovered what the Academy did, and by making an knowledge to the public, they stole five fires of reserve course students who had long been dissatisfied with how they've been treated. And the uprising began, and that held the Hope Speak Academy to destruction. This is the, this is the entirety of the tragedy of Hope Speak Academy. No, it's not. We are not. Talking about the fact 2,000 students went did the hang game. Played hangman with each other. This is, that's the sad part. That's why they call it the most awful and the most misery and fight and the most self awful Eventually, that incident would lead to the horrifying, devastating incident. The incident that would known as the biggest, most awful, most tragic event in human history. We're excited. Dangan Rumpa Zero. With a heavy sigh, I closed the manga. Am I. am I supposed to believe this? There's no way 13 people were killed at Hope Speak Academy. <laughs> what irony! For genius known as the ultimate hope to cause such a gruesome incident. A talent like that is too regal for society. It's like trying to buy juice with a bar of gold. Why not? Uh, to buy juice with a bar of gold, only an asshole asks for change. Let's play it just saying. Only a real dickbag asks for change. <laughs> you should be lucky that you're incompetent. Damn it. Why does it lead up to something offensive? Seriously pisses me off. But ultimate hope? I need to mention that before too. But it looks like it means something completely different here. What Nagito said was the true meaning of hope. But for Israel, hope simply means talent. More importantly, a genius who possess possesses various talents. I wish they'd given me one of those talents so I didn't have to be in reserve department. The irony, indeed, Monokuma, the irony. That's right, the reserve department. Here, it said the reserve, reserve course students in the reserve department began an uprising. Then, what about me? Was I a participant too? No, that's not possible. There's no way. I have no reason to do something like that. Well, let's be real, he was also like on the edge of his seat and it wasn't for Chiaki because Chiaki was his hope and by this new, by, by, by disappearing Chiaki, he, he lost his hope and, and his memories and his self-righteousness and his assholity went through the roof. Anyway, I've learned about the Chinese Host Week Academy, but the biggest most awful most tragic event in human history is far, far, the far worst incident, right? What kind of incident was it? Who is this other student that is in Israel? A certain student who secretly used the incident to their advantage. Who is that? This incident is really messed up. All it's doing is raising more questions. The mysteries just keep piling up. I'm gonna end this video soon actually. I hope you guys don't mind. Like I said, zombie cringes. I can't do I can't do whole videos, honestly. Rodo 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 Yes Rodo The door is Fucking Fucking I knew they left us into the Rodo
doors, I tell you, doors. Well, what the hell is with this room? It's freaking cold in here. It's like I'm in a freezer or something. I just stand still, I might end up freezing to death. I should hurry up and investigate so I can get out of here already. Well, the art style of this manga reminds me of, you know, that I, I think it's an anime. Well, of course it was a manga first, but um, the intro of it is that, that dude that screams in it like, I, 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 you know what I'm talking about. That creepy uh, psychological horror where a little kid kills everybody. There's another manga that's laying around here. This time the title is Manga for Manga for Moana to become awful child child in human history. Ah, I knew it. Next one will obviously be about this incident. The biggest, most awful, most tragic event in human history, huh? So what was that incident really all about? It might turn out to be something lame. Oh man, he's so invested into this manga series. And then Monokuma's like, no! No more manga! <laughs> uh, and then we kicked Monokuma's ass and he killed us. I would kick his ass. You take away the manga, man. You stop me off with yeah, I'm not going to look at my life again. Promise me season two. It never got season two, man. It's season two in my head. Flip through the pages of the manga and hope that I was right. Man, it, I'm, it really looks like a story about creepily drawn characters who get involved with such horrifying incidents. Murder tube. Murder tube. What's more fucked up in Murder tube? I can think of a few, but I don't remember their names. Most of their names in Japanese, and I was never able to tra translate the names. What about the check? That was like this, and I, I don't want to get into that one. Don't, don't, don't. You've read a lot of fucked up shit, a lot of dark psychological shit. It, 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 it messes, it messes a person's mindset on life up. Okay, people are into dark manga specifically, not anime, because anime really gets it as dark as the manga can do it. You cannot be into it for a prolonged period of time without feeling like you're insane, messed up, or deserve therapy. Like, you deserve it. Someone else must go get you therapy. Because you're not gonna do it. And for me, I was never into the whole psychological thing. I was just curious about a few of them. Went to go read it and did not come out the same at the other, at the other end of the tunnel. Got to the other end of the tunnel and my face was all like... Dear God, what have I watched? What have I seen? I can never get these memories out of my mind ever again. That's exactly how you're supposed to walk out at the end of the tunnel. Anybody who walks out the other side of a tunnel from a psychological or a manga or polydysmorphia of the extremities, the extreme ones, at the end of the tunnel, you're not the same. Don't even get me started in H time, man. Don't even get me started in those engines, man. It's just, it's just. Curiosity killed the cat. Now, a cat has nine lives. And if the cat is determined enough, it won't lose one life. It will survive with that one life. But the other eight lives are shaking in fear because they don't know how they're gonna die. A story about creepily drawn characters who get in involved in such horrifying incidents. An incident known as the biggest, most awful, most tragic event in human history. It's drawn so grotesquely because the incident itself is that grotesque. Anyway, the beginning of this creepy manga starts with this sentence. Tragedy of Speak Academy was simply the trigger. The first an uprising, the first, at first the uprising by the reserve corps students uh, that triggered the, the Tragedy of Speak Academy was initially hoped to be resolved quickly, but the situation continued to escalate to dangerous extremities. Hey, 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 this isn't Rudy Sandstorm. This isn't, no, no. Yo, chill, chill. Lights on, lights on. The movement started spreading all over the internet and fostered a thriving online community. The community was not limited to students and people of various races nations began joining in. By the moment, but the movement was not confined to the internet and began spreading and reopening the real world. When the movement started, it wasn't distinguishable from any other demonstration inspired by social unrest. I still say that Danganronpa is kinda 
but some things are far-fetched but causing something like this is not impossible it's just that currently there's too many sane people in the world to do this so you'd have to make more insane people by giving them hope and utterly destroying it taking an advantage and then ah uh, too many good ideas for a person who wants to destroy the world yeah game but as I spread across the world, certain abnormality and abnormalities soon came to light. By then it was too late, the ends of the means has vanished, and the wanton destruction became the law became their only goal. The strong butcher of the weak. The weak kill the weakest among them. And soon the weak formed factions to brutally murder the strong. As the violence and death continued to spread, the shock of the actions began to disappear, as if the arrows regressed into more uncivilized times when Cephalus deaths were the norm. The media was oversaturated with deaths to the point where people would watch them while they were enjoying a meal. Oh, yeah, yeah, honey, uh, that man is surely killing that, that woman utterly brutally. Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> and the wife's on the other side, and the wife's like, Oh, I know, hun. This is sewing. I know, hun. How is your meal, by the way? Oh, my meal is fine. <laughs> Why, honey? Why would you kill me? <laughs> I never liked him in the first place. Wow, you went like what's he so killing us? So you kill so that's what you're saying, right? At the time, I realized what I'd become. It was too late to start what had already happened. A feeling of immense despair began spreading and eventually engulfed the world. Acts of terrorism and coup began occurring around the world. The world waged in the name of despair. A war fought on not, not for principles, religion, or personal gain. Just war. Pure war. And because of that, there was no way to resolve it. How could a movement started by high school students progress such a hopeless scenario? The only explanation is the existence of a certain organization. Devoted with a certain student who influenced Open League Academy, a group called Ultimate Despair. Used, instead of using Open Academy's talents for the sake of mankind's hope, they used it for the sake of mankind's despair. Key members of society used the influence to brainwash the masses in order to spread despair. Text savvy computer programmers wrote software to spread despair, the powerful influence to create new values and models to spread despair, and with this, I created the tragedy, the biggest most awful most tragic event in human history. As long as our ultimate despair exists, then despair engulfing the world will never end. The tragedy will never end. Ooh. And I'm on the other, and uh, yeah, this is the reaction that you're supposed to have when you're on the other side. My heart was reading, my racing, my chest, but my body felt ice cold. That is the exact reaction you have on the other side of the tunnel. I'm happy that ever since I had a stroke, my memory's fucked up. Cause a lot of stuff I did when I was like in primary school, going high school type of thing. And I don't know, let's say primary school, let's say like a beginning, middle high school. And if I had to remember half the shit I read, I'd be scared to look at my own shadow 90% of the time. Uh, what about demons under the bed and shit? They've been talking about the rape demons under the bed. Yeah, it was that one. What's wrong with people? And it wasn't because I was freezing in this room. The biggest, awful, most tragic event in human history? This is definitely all made up. I mean, this is really true. And what's happening in the outside world? My family? My friends? The convenience store I frequent? The nearby bookstore? My favorite restaurant. What's happened to them? No way! Hey, are you in a serious? Are you serious yelling at manga? How crazy are you? Oh, would enjoy reading something like this. Wow! Oh my! You don't like manga? Ooh. A high school student who doesn't like manga is like an office lady who doesn't like to eat candy. An office lady who doesn't like to eat candy? That's a thing. Wait, 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 an office lady who does like to eat cat, and that's a thing. Enough. What is this messed up manga? <laughs> I don't feel like laughing as you, Monokuma. I thought you'd obviously know about such a horrible event that destroyed the world, but... For you not to remember such, such despair. That's Future Foundation's fault, though. Thanks to them stealing your school memories. The incident that happened during that period has been completely removed from your brains. This incident really happened. And I actually forgot about it? There's no way that's possible. What are 
are you saying? How many times do I have to tell you that all the clues here are real? Hello. Please understand, I'm rooting for you. If we don't learn about the full extent of the outside world, you guys will suffer for it. <laughs> I just want to help you guys so you can live well adjust the dives in the outside world. I see. So that's how it is. That's what he meant by this that's what he meant by what he said at the beginning. Well, as a headmaster, I'm conflicted, you know. On one hand, I'm really happy that you're finally going to graduate. But on the other hand, I'm worried about whether you guys will be okay in the outside world. That's why I'm thinking of telling you what's on the outside world before you make a decision. Whether you want to leave Jawok Island or stay here. He's trying to make us feel despair towards the outside world. So he wants to stay on this island. But there's no way I'm going to do what he wants. The spell I got is simply can't exist. The outside world will be f should be filled with hope. Just like now. Perhaps, no, that's definitely it. I end this video here. We can continue the tragedy in the next video. Uh, Cause I, like I said, I can't do videos very long. My body's not up for that right now. Uh, it's a man of a little cringe. Just want you to like, subscribe, smack your face with the keyboard a couple of times. Don't notify guests always. And check out all our links in the description. And uh, yeah, pray for me. Um, um, play a uh, happy, jolly tune, yeah? I was finally able to attain Hope Speak Academy. I finally thought I'd become confident in myself. Even so, I... Why did you become Hope? If that's what you're thinking, just stop it. Listen carefully. The only humans worthy of becoming Hope possess amazing talents and a strong will. And the moment you're born into this world, you either have it or you don't.